press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Adram Hunter Quinn from Afghanistan and in this video I am going to show you two ways to connect to any Wi-Fi without password on Android devices. For this method you don't have to install any kind of apps and also you don't have to root your Android devices. Remember this video is only for educational purpose and I'm not promoting any kind of illegal activities through this video. The method shown in this video is 100% legal and it doesn't harm privacy or property of someone else. So if this video helped you in any way then please share it with your friends. Sharing is always free and it doesn't cost anything. So please do share this video with your friends that will be considered a big support from you guys. So with that being said let's get started. Okay, our first method is using WPS push button to connect Wi-Fi without password and for that you must have access to the router or modem that is broadcasting Wi-Fi signal. So as you can see when I go to my phone settings and go to Wi-Fi, I can see a Wi-Fi but when I try to connect it, it asks for the password which I don't know. To connect to this Wi-Fi, first of all take the modem or router and there you should see a button by the name of WPS. Every router has WPS push button at the back side of the router or modem. So all you have to do is just press this WPS push button. Once you've done that, there you should see WPS light is blinking. Now you have exactly 60 seconds to connect your phone to this router. To do that, go to your phone settings go to Wi-Fi now go to option there you should see an option by the name of WPS push button just tap on it and this is gonna take few seconds and it will connect without password okay now you can see it says connect to Wi-Fi now let's check so let's go to YouTube As you can see, it's working without any hesitation. If the first method didn't work for you, then you have another option to connect your phone to Wi-Fi without entering the password. On second method, you have to find a phone that is already connected with a Wi-Fi that you want to connect. In my case, my this phone is already connected and this phone is not connected yet. To get internet access on this phone, you must share Wi-Fi connection from the phone that is already connected. To do that, first of all, you have to pair both of these phones via Bluetooth. Okay, first go to the phone that is not connected to Wi-Fi yet. Now go to settings, go to connections and turn on Bluetooth. After that, go to another phone, go to Bluetooth and turn it on. As I said before, pair both devices with Bluetooth. Once your phones are paired together, just go back and go to tethering and mobile hotspot. In your case, interface might be different. All you have to do is find tethering and mobile hotspot. Just tap on it and turn on Bluetooth tethering. All you have to do. On second phone, now go to the phone that is paired, just tap on it. Now you should have internet access. Now you can see the sign of Bluetooth has been changed. So now my this phone has internet access. As you can see here it says connect to the access internet connection. Now you can see I have internet access on it. So let's see. Let's go to some website. Let's go to YouTube first. Now you can see it's working fine. Now let's go to another website. As you can see, it's working perfectly. So there you have it guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you learned something new from this video, then please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to share this with your friends. And if you want more videos like this, then please subscribe to this channel with notification on. And I'll catch you on the next one. Have a wonderful day.